I wanted to go to law school, but I had no money. I got a job for the summer uh, after grad school and before law school as, as a headhunter for a personnel company in Manhattan. No salary, a desk, a telephone, and I would get a commission for everyone I placed. I was going to start the job on a Monday morning in June, uh, and on Saturday night, right before that, I was driving home from a movie, and a guy who had had too much to drink went through a red light, hit the car, and I ended up uh, in the hospital. As a result, I lost the job. So there I was sitting there in June um, with crutches, thinking about law school fading away. Uh, my tuition was due at the end of August and I had no money. A friend of mine, whom I knew, uh, had gotten a job with a publishing company. By total coincidence, he called me. He said, we are uh, interested in doing a high school textbook. Do you think you could uh, create a manuscript for the book? And I said, well, I'll do it, but uh, I need an advance. And he said, how much do you need? And I said, I need $2,600. That was my tuition bill. Fortunately, uh, New York City had two things that were very important, a subway system uh, and the best public library in the world. And so I got on the subway every day with my crutches, and I came down to uh, this building and uh, sat for about four weeks with index cards and, and wonderful primary source material, uh, and I did the book. Uh, they gave me my advance, and I went to law school. So my name is Evan Chesler. Uh, I'm the chairman of a law firm called Cravath, Swain and & Moore, and I'm the chairman of the board of trustees of the New York Public Library. I grew up near the Allerton branch uh, in the Bronx, and uh, that's where I would meet my friends. I wanted to be involved in the library because when I needed a place, a safe, warm place as a kid, uh, it was there. And when I needed a place to do research as a young scholar, uh, earn my way into law school, it was there. I know that there are young people uh, out in the boroughs uh, who are dreaming about their future uh, and who don't have the resources to get there on their own, and they need a lot of help. And one of the things that they need is the New York Public Library.